Hey guys, and welcome back to Countdown Vampires. When we last left off, uh, we fought, we fought, we fought, we fought, yeah, we fought. We fought a weird giant frog thing, which, let's, you know, not split hairs. We fought a hunter, and uh, he actually appeared to come for us as well. He was, like, tracking us down. Now, um, I haven't played this game for 17 days. So it's been <laughs> it's been a little while, uh, and I just have to blow the old dust off the old brain piece and uh, work out exactly where we were going. We got the Y key. Uh, I know that much. Now I've also had a load of information sent to me um, by Reva of Geo Sandwiches uh, on my Discord, and some of the information that he's shown me about this game is really interesting. It basically explains, like, when you hit a loading point, you know, you get that um, moon graphic come up with the clouds swirling over it and stuff. That actually means something. Oh, fuck. And I instinctively went to push uh, the right trigger there to aim, and that is not what happens on this game. Uh, yeah, so... Apparently, depending on the color of the moon, that indicates the behavior of the enemies. There's also loads of information um, on how the vampires react, whether they're going to be running around on the floor, whether they're going to be upright, whether they're going to be slow shamblers. Apparently, that's to do with the color of the moon. There's also loads of different passwords and things that we can put in and that we can name ourselves. And that actually affects the game. Now, um, Chris also told me this and sent me a load of information. And I have mean, been meaning to check that out. But what we will do, we'll check that out once we've completed the game. Now, to get the best rank, from what I can understand, we need to save 30% of the vampires. Right? That's to get the best rank. And we have to complete it in less than seven hours. Uh, I don't think we're going to get an S rank. Maybe an A rank. Um, that's definitely possible. Apparently there's between 100 and 155 vampires in this game. You only have to save like 30% uh, of them. Which is, depending on how many you get, between 30 and, and 40. Maybe 50 tops. Uh, and we've definitely done that, so everything's gravy, baby. And there's a whole load of other information about this game as well, how it ties into other games, and I will go through it at a later date, maybe at the end of the game. But it's really, really interesting stuff, and because there is so little on this game, that was kind of a treasure trove of information that, uh, that Reva dug up for me there, and it was a fascinating read. Uh, only, you know, a couple pages worth, but it was really good, interesting stuff. Anyway, we've got a hunter problem. And I need to remember. There we go. Oh, God. Okay. Okay. Okay, it's going to be like that, is it? It's going to be like that. Maybe, just maybe, we should have brought our magnum oh dude Oof. yeah they really took us to pound town right there didn't they ow actually that wasn't too bad to be 100% honest with you this shotgun is not that fantastic against these things, actually. It takes a lot of shots. Probably why we have the Magnum now. Okay. Apparently in the second part of the game as well, you start um, coming across a lot fewer vampires, and it's more monsters, which I guess we could have assumed anyway. Oh, Jesus. <sighs> we don't actually need to be in this room, do we? Okay. I need to remember my way around this place. Yeah. These things are everywhere now, man. Might actually be worth drinking that ooze. There we go. Oh, yeah. The number of circuits in use as well. 
uh, which is just above our gun there, says 139. That's how many save slots you have left. Which was also in that information dump. Uh, yeah. Didn't expect that. So there's only a limited amount of save slots in this game. I mean, it's a lot. But... Oh, shit, son. Ah, stop doing that. I've been playing too much of that um, other game. Right, come to Papa. Oh, it looks like there's always two of them. Always two of them. How many does it take? We can get them both. Yep, we need to reload. Oh, we have reloaded. Why is he reloading so fast? Are we getting like hit out of the animation? Maybe. We're really using the shotgun shells here, though. Well, finally. Looks like we have a somewhat worthy adversary. At least something a little bit more interesting to fight than those stupid vampire things. Yeah, those things aren't, aren't slouches. They'll uh, certainly kick you in the ass. That's for sure. Okay. There's also been an update for this emulator for Duck Station, uh, which has really fucked up all of my save states and stuff. Which, again, kids, that's why you don't rely on save states. I'm just saying, save states are bad. Always make hard saves. Of course, I guess it could have screwed up with our memory cards as well, but hey, <laughs> we got lucky, damn it. Alright, so... I mean, I'm pretty sure we were finished with this evil house place. Oh, it's so nice. It's so nice to have that. That instant map button. Oh yeah, we couldn't go through there, could we? Because, um... I've been playing The Ring, and... Oh man, I actually finished that game. Uh in the time that I haven't gone back to this. And man, you know, if you needed a game to make you appreciate this one, play the ring. This game is like better, absolutely better. This is Resident Evil God tier in comparison to that slurry. Oh fuck, you made me jump. Not many games do that. Not many games do that at all. You made me jump, sir. And for that transgression, you must suck my shotgun. Yeah, I think what's happening is we're going to reload our shotgun. How many shots do they actually take? Yeah, they... Right, they're taking seven shotgun shells. We need to... Ah, fucking hell. Come to Papa. One. Oh, didn't even stop him. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Yep. Seven shotgun shells to put these guys down. These are naughty little puppies. Yeah, seven. These are naughty little sausages, aren't they? Oh, yeah. We like go down here now. We like drain the pool, didn't we? Uh, we did, but <laughs> I love the way they just like deflate once you shoot them. They're just like full of hot air or something. Uh, now are these things going to be everywhere now. Uh, probably it's locked. Wait, I thought that was open. Didn't we see that open back up? Ah, oh. yeah, it looks like there's a ladder that we can go down, but why? I tried. I tried, damn it. I tried. I tried my best. Let's try that again, shall we? Now we're going down. Okay. Uh, right. I'm gonna be honest. Can't see much down here. Looks like we can push that, though. Can we? <clears throat> There's a bronze statue. There's a movable rail below it. Yeah, we can see that. 
Uh, can we just not push it? I would have thought we could just push this thing. Well, I mean, we can't push it that way. We can't push it that way. Okay. Um, is there a button we can push? I'm guessing that's what's stopping the door from opening. Wait, hang on. Oh, we do have... Oh, wait. Have I made a mistake? Probably. Ah, uh, it has letters carved into it. What could they possibly mean? Right, we need those tablet doodads, don't we? Yes. Uh, shit. Bugger. Of course we do. I was doing inventory management, wasn't I? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Us. Do we really have to get all the way back to get to our items? Yeah, it looks like it. Okay. Well, that's a hell of a first episode. Hey, at least we've got to waste some monsters along the way, right? I mean, that was fun. We've got plenty of health as well. So, you know, in the item boxes, wait a minute. That's the way we came in, wasn't it? Which one of these ways? Yeah, there was two ways to go. Oh, man, that's the wrong way, I think. I think we're supposed to be going this way. Let's double check, because I don't want to make more of an ass of myself than that. Yeah, so I was just about to make an ass of myself, you see. This is why we check the map, kids. This is why we check the map. Right, let's go back. Now, I wonder if we've got more of those uh, hunters to fight. They definitely look like hunter baiters. I think it's the hunter baiters. Well, they, they kind of look like the old school Hunter uh, Gammas, actually. Not the ones from Resident Evil 3 Remake. Because, boy, they they really changed them. They, uh, yeah, they, they really, really changed what the Hunter Gammas look like. I actually kind of like them, to be honest. I think they made them look pretty cool. But they don't really look like Hunters anymore. At all, to be honest. I like what they did with um, the standard hunters. They were really cool. The good old, was it MA121s? Yeah, MA121s. They were pretty burly. In fact, I'm going to make an opinion here. I think the OG um, hunters are really boring to fight once you've you know when you go back to resident evil um the originals and then you see the new hunters oh the new hunters and that same can be said for the new liquors as well they're really really gnarly enemies let's save that now we've wasted all those monsters we're gonna go for memory card one because of course we are is this emulator, I think, auto? Yeah, auto uses a, a new memory card for every game. Although I have it, so... Memory card 2 is a shared memory card. <laughs> right. So, we need... Is it worth taking some more health? I mean, it might be. Oh, God, how many bloody panels is there? Oh, Jesus. Wow, we got a lot more magnum ammo than I thought we did. Oh, boy. That gives us... Oh, jeez. That gives us 40... 44 rounds. Yeah. Jeebus. No, it doesn't. What am I saying? Right, uh, let's go back. 
Okay, now, um, right. Uh, yes, it does give us 44 rounds. Of course it does. 27 plus 7, yeah. Idiot. Okay, cool. Let's go. Right. 20 plus 14. It's actually 34, but shush. Right, let's go. Let's go, daddy -o. Yeah. Why did I say 44? Maybe because I was thinking of a 44 Magnum. I don't know. I used to be an engineer. I swear. I swear. Right, let's go. Let's go. We've got the tablets. Um, now, I don't know if we have to put these tablets in any particular order. I guess we probably do because they're numbered. So, you know. And that's going to spell out something for us i'm not really sure do we, oh right maybe we need some kind of password for the um uh what do you call it because we've got the y key which we have to put into a machine to regulate power yes yes images memories they're all coming back to me now uh, now, we needed to do something with that. Now, it's not going to be as easy as putting the key and flicking the switch. <laughs> no, 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 because we've got a computer screen and everything. Which, let's be honest, that means we're going to have some bullshit puzzle to uh, play around with. Ah. Talking of bullshit puzzle, I have my notes and things here. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, not... But, yeah. Yeah, we really, we really don't have many notes, do we? It's more letters. Okay, cool. Right. Ah, uh, did we even? Do we even know? Like, is was there any way? There's. Hmm. Well, it's four numbers. Uh, I don't think we've written four numbers down anywhere. So we've got five, six, seven, and... F uh, so we've got four, five, six, and seven. Uh, 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 well, let's just put them in the correct order. I oh, oh, right. Oh, last. Uh, like the puzzle. Ah, oh, man. Oh, that actually says last on it. So that. That well, that says projects project sin. Uh, what are... That looks just like a mess of words. That is also a mess of words. Okay, so one... One panel, which is apparently the last panel, uh, says Project Sin. Right? Do we have to cover up? Hmm. Do we have to cover that up? 
Let's try. Right, okay. I see. Right. Yeah, I'm guessing we need to make Project Sin. But does it matter? Like, oh, combination is different. Right. Yeah. So I guess when we put the last piece in, it still has to say Project Sin. Right. Okay. Um. All right, that's not quite as complicated as I thought that would be. Uh, right. So what, I guess these... You can't actually change the order of them. Because, all right, okay, fine. Uh, so. No, not quite. All right, um. I don't know which does it matter what these numbers are I mean it might make it might be easier if I could write that down and reference that so but there's no real way of doing that is there? um Just go for it. Uh, I mean, they always come out. Are they coming out in the same order? Right, let's try. You. You. Uh. Hey, there we go. Okay, cool. Did we match Project Sin up though? I thought there was another letter still. It's fine. We don't care. All that we care about is the fact that the door's open now. Okay. So we have a yellow moon. I, don't know, I can't remember what the yellow moon means. I think that means we're going to have like shamblers. Let's find out. If memory serves, anyway. Oh, good. Yes, I forgot about this. All right, let's go. Full speed ahead. All systems, full power. I mean, at least, you know, we're in this, like, fun house of murder. We might as well have some fun whilst we're doing it, right? Uh, okay, cool. So we're back. Now, we need to go back to that control room which was uh was that the control room maybe can't remember i know we've got two rooms that are potentially control rooms but i can't remember it's been about 658,000 years oh, okay let's try ah that's so annoying don't you hate it when you're used to playing and oh wait they're werewolves 
Let's give the AR some some time to shine. Uh yeah. I mean, ow, my face. Yeah, the AR kind of sucks. Yeah, the AR really sucks anus when it comes to uh. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Um. All right, we're gonna have to be careful here. Come on, big boy. There we go. How do you like them apples, huh? Huh? Yeah, you ain't got nothing, boy. What you got, son? Glad we brought the shotgun, that's all I can say. All right, I think we're good. I think we're good. Knowing we're good and thinking we're good, unfortunately, are two different things. Okay, we're fine. Yeah, right, so these things are now like slow shamblers. That's interesting. So let me write that down um, to try and... Yellow moon, and can we influence that by like leaving the area and then coming back in? That would be very interesting. Yellow moon, slow. Yeah, interesting. That would be really freaking cool if that's how that works. Uh. We could save these guys. Let's give let's soften them up with a few rounds from this thing. Um not what I wanted to do, is it? Right. Let's soften you up. I know there's a quick switch. Okay. Oh god. Yeah, there's a few of them. Yeah, they're getting back up. Okay. Might have to kill some of these. How many shots do we have left? Two. Right. Let's. I don't want to kill you. I actually really didn't want to kill you. But I only have so many darts. Well, there should be another four saved. Which is a thing. Let's go spread our white juice all over these ladies' backs. It's not bad. Four. Four in one go. It's quite a spray, to be honest. Um, now, let's go up here. And hopefully we can find a save. Oh, dear. We've got to go all the way. These. We're going to have to kill some of these, aren't we? Because we don't have a fucking choice. We might be able to save one. Oh man, they're really slow as well, so they would be easy as hell to save. Sorry, ladies. I'm genuinely sorry here for this. Trust me, ladies, I'd rather not have to put you down. Oh, she actually stumbled there. So there is a small chance that we can stun her. Yeah, I think think she might be stunned. Right. Well, we put a load over her back. So hopefully she's feeling a little bit better. Oh, dear. Well, at least, you know, when they're slow and shambly like this, they're not hard to avoid, right? 
I mean, they really did throw a lot of these at us, uh, which is fine, but they're not resupplying us with supplies. <laughs> um, <laughs> you know, so the fact that we only have to put 20 or 30% of them down, uh, I'm actually happy with that because that would be really difficult otherwise let's be honest here right i'm gonna save it here guys because we're out of time <sighs> we're definitely not going to be completing this game in the part time that's for sure now unfortunately to unlock the good stuff we need to complete it under seven hours which is quite a tight time frame to be honest with you but uh anyway i hope you enjoyed that I have, and as always, till next time.